Hello from Slovenia again. Today I will use this world's smallest blower that Doris, my friend and fellow artist Doris, sent me. And I will do just kind of a Dutch pour. It will not be a Dutch pour because uh, uh, I will not do. Uh, I will not use a hair dryer, but it will be a, a blowout thing. I don't know how to say that. Probably, not probably, definitely some people used blow dryer in their fluid art or acrylic pouring before the Dutch pour technique became popular. So, uh, it will be just that kind of pour. And uh, I just used the same consistency paint that I normally use. I didn't thin them down. Uh, this is just white mixed with my pouring medium. And I have some paints from uh, yesterday's life and last week's pours. So I will just use some paints. I will list all the colors that I will use into the description box. So <clears throat> if you like this color combo, you can check the description box and you will see which colors I used. Okay, my base is done. I will just wipe my hands a little bit and turn off one of my lights that it will not be as much glare in this in the canvas so what I will do next is I will torch for air bubbles to get rid of these air bubbles And I will just drizzle, kind of drizzle some paint here in the middle. This is Extreme Sheen Aquamarine, just like that. And Extreme Sheen Sapphire Blue, oops, you see they are pretty thick. don't want as much and I will add some permanent blue violet from Amsterdam maybe there this will be too much extreme sheen paints and some extreme sheen gold whoop probably too much I could just add a little more of this violet on top of this gold and Windsor Newton Opera Rose okay and I will pour just a little white around just to make sure that my paint will flow nicely torch this again and I will grab my blow dryer not blow dryer try to blow this out as nice as I can
and obviously I have my paint way too thick for this I should have thinned it down because I don't like these parts around, you see? These parts that probably I can't do nothing about that. I like the middle but don't like those parts there so I will scrape this off and I hope that I have enough paint. I will thin it down a little bit because it was definitely too thick for this kind of pour. because I will not have enough for both sides I will just try to go with one side and see what I can do or just
I just wish that I would have enough white to cover this part too. I will just check if I have some white somewhere. I think that I should have left. Have a little bit here, but not much, no. I have just pearl white. But I have black. What if I scrape this part off too and add black to this side? Let's see what will happen. So, uh, if you don't like something, it's not necessary that you ruined your painting you can try some new things try to fix it sometimes it's oh, it works sometimes it doesn't but you can try okay have my black left oh, it's not thick so i will just pour black around here okay and I will just grab another palette knife because I have this palette knife totally messed Not completely, but I will just do this and I will just blow this out with my mouth again. something here
Okay. I will leave it like it is now because kind of like colors and the composition is okay I don't like this part just a little I think that I will leave it like it is. Maybe I have to too much of these wispy lines here, but I will just leave it. Sorry guys, I'm a little, I try to be, try to be uh, uh, focused, but I get some really bad news today about a friend of mine, so I'm not in a really good mood. But I want to paint because this was the part that we have in common with my friend. So um, I try not to. I didn't want to talk about that, but <coughs> I know that some of you will feel that because a lot of people know me and know when I'm not myself today I definitely I'm not myself <clears throat> so I hope I save this <clears throat> I, I kind of like it, I have to say, maybe just a little too much white here, maybe I will blow this part a little more, but it's not so bad that it was at first. Uh, so, this is it for today, and sorry that... I was a little sad because of our dear friend Erica from Eric Art who passed away. So sorry and see you on the next one. Bye.